गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू द वीडियो सेशन इन दिस वीडियो सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डू द एक्सरसाइज फोर पी एंड वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व द क्वेश्चन नंबर टू इन दिस क्वेश्चन नंबर द थिंग्स दैट आर गिवन टू अस आर एल इज पैरल टू एम एंड टी इज आर वर्स सो हियर आई है L, M are parallel and T is the transverse. Okay. Next thing we are given us angle one is two, angle two is five is two seven. Means angle one and two are in the ratio five is two seven. Then what we need to find? We need to find the angle one, two, three, and eight. So, how we can find the angle one and two as it is given in a ratio? So, when we take this line, that is M line, M line is a straight, and this T is standing on this line. So, we are forming a linear bit. This angle one and angle two are forming a linear pair. And we know that the sum of the linear pair is equal to one eighty degree. So here the angle one plus angle two will make one eighty degree. So here, because it is given in ratio, so we will take net. We will write here net the angle. Let the angle one and angle two be five x. The ratio are five and seven, so we will take five x and seven x. Okay. Now we can write here that five x plus seven. Is equal to one eighty degree. The reason is linear pair. So right here, linear pair. Okay. Now five plus seven, we will get two one. So two one x is equal to one eighty degree. So x is equal to one one eighty divided by two one. Two one 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 two one two one one two one. Twelve five plus sixty. That is equal to fifty degree. So x we got as fifty degree. Okay. Now we are taking angle one to be five x. So what will be the measure of angle one? The angle one is equal to five x. That is equal to one five into x. X value we got fifty. So we will write fifty. That is seventy five degree. So angle one is equal to seventy five degree. In the same way, angle two. The so angle two we are taking as seven x. So we will write here seven x. That is seven into x. X value is fifty. So fifty seven jump one hundred five degree. So we got angle one is equal to seventy five degree, angle two is equal to one hundred five degree. So angle one we have found seventy five, angle two we have found one hundred five degree. Now we have asked us to find the angle three. Okay, so how we will find angle three? So again, if we take angle three, here, but three, here it is going to be three. Now, five, five here, three, and so I need to find the angle. Three. So now you see when I am taking this T as the 
transversal as a line and this ray is standing on this one. So again angle 2 and 3 are forming what? Linear pair. So with the help of this linear pair method we can find the angle 3. So here we will write angle 2 plus angle 3 is equal to 180 degree. Again we can mention the reason linear pair. Okay. So angle 2 already we know that is 105 degree plus angle 3 is equal to 180 degree. So we need to find angle 3. So we need to here angle 3 is equal to 180 degree minus when you pass position, when you go from left hand side towards the right hand side, then if it is plus, then we make it minus. So here it will become minus 105 degree. So angle 3 is equal to how much? 180 minus 105, we will get 75 degree. So angle 3, we have got here 75 degree. Okay, so we have found angle 1, angle 2, angle 3. Now we need to find angle A. So what, how can we find the angle A? So you see here, angle 2 and angle A are related to each other. How they are related? They are alternate exterior angles. And alternate exterior angles measures are equal. So, whatever is the measure of angle 2 will be the measure of angle A also. So, we can write here angle 2, angle 2 is equal to angle A. That is equal to how much? 105 degree. What reason do you write? We will write here alternate. Alternate exterior exterior angles. So we got angle A as one hundred five. So whatever the question has asked us to find, we have found the answer. Angle one we have asked, we have got seventy five. Angle 2 they had asked, we have got 105 degree. Then they had asked for angle 3, we have got the answer 75 degree. And they had asked for angle A, is, that is 105 degree. So this is how you can find the answer of question number 2, exercise 14. Okay, so I hope you understood this one. You watch the video and try to solve the question. Thank you.